Hi, this is Matt, and today I'm looking at the VMware Horizon Help Desk Tool. Help Desk Tool is a feature of the VMware Horizon Management Console. What it will do is help me with troubleshooting, so when, I have, for example, a use case might be remote users are coming in from their, their home devices or bring your own, and of course when that happens, you don't always have visibility of what those endpoints are. So that's one of the use cases of the Help Desk Tool. It will see me who they are, what they're connected in from, what operating system they're running, um, but equally, it will also show me how their virtual machine is performing, what applications they're running. And when I say virtual machine, that could be VDI desktop or it could be remote desktop session host. So all I've done is in this virtual desktop is launch the management console. And then from here, I'm going to search for a user. And I will actually search for myself as a user because I know I'm connected. Um, in terms of some of the data that's returned, you can see here, it shows me my active sessions. So one of those is my remote desktop session host. The other is a Windows 10 VDI. You can see that from a protocol side, they're both using the VMware Blast protocol. You can see when I connected and how long I've been logged in. If I look at my access in general, so the desktop tab doesn't mean these desktops are currently being accessed by me. What that's showing me is the desktops I have um, privileges to access. So when I go into the Horizon client, these are the shortcuts that I see. So a Linux desktop, remote desktop position host desktop, uh, high-end NVIDIA, um, Windows 10 VDI machine, Windows 7, and another Windows 10 VDI. And similarly, if I go into the applications, these are mm. the published applications from uh, an RDSH um, desktop, or RDSH host that I have access to. If I come back to the sessions tab, and we'll actually dive in and look at uh, the, the Windows 10 desktop in particular, I can see details, I can see my endpoint, I can see the OS and, and the, the client version I've connected in from. I can also look at the specific details of the virtual machine, so the Horizon Agent version that's running, as well as the version of operating system, whether it's connected, um, how, how long login took, um, as well as various information around CPU, memory usage, network, disk performance. Processes will show me the current processes, so a bit like Windows Task Manager. So I can see, and I would know if uh, somebody phoned the, the help desk and said to me, oh, you know, I'm running Internet Explorer or Chrome or Edge and performance is terrible. I could look here and it may show that the CPU consumption of that process is 90%. So you'd know what the problem is. It also shows you whether they are processes that have been triggered by me as a user, or whether they're system processes. If I go into applications, this will show me the specific applications that are running. So in this case, I have triggered Google and I trigger the Horizon client. So that's actually what's running in this desktop. If I go back to the details tab, down here, you'll see some uh, additional options. So the ability to trigger remote assistance. And I also have a um, additional drop down with the right privileges. Um, I could trigger disconnect or log off or reset. So if you wanted to allow the help desk team to maybe reset virtual machines or log users off, you wouldn't necessarily have to give them access to the vCenter client. You could purely give them some access through the help desk tool to carry out some of those tasks. So that was the main thing I wanted to show, just a quick overview of the VMware help desk tool and see where it fits and how it can be used. I hope you found it useful. Thanks for your time.